Y'all, Christmas is like next week or two months ago, depending on when you watch this video. But for me, it's next week, okay? And I haven't been home for Christmas in like three years. I haven't been home for like three years. I've been living in my car in LA. I finally got an apartment last month, but that's all besides the point, okay? This will be the first year in like three years that I can fly home for Christmas and see all my family, okay? So they're gonna wonder, what have I been up to these past three years and I have nothing to show for it. I gotta prove to my grandma that living in my car in LA somehow was worth it and it bettered my life in some way. <laughs> So I'm gonna paint a Bob Ross for her. So since it's Christmas or March, depending on when you're watching, um, I'm just gonna paint the Christmas Eve snow. Where's Bob? That intro was so long. <laughs> Bob, you know I have to have this done by Christmas, right? My grandma's 70 something. Time is of the essence. Let's get started. Have them run all the colors across the screen that you need to paint along with me. And they'll come across in the same order as I have them on the palette, starting with the white and working around. Today, as you can plainly see, I have a black canvas up here. And I... You have a what? I do what now, Bob? Bob, no, no. Bob, my grandma, 70. Bob, did you buy a black canvas? Or am I gonna have to paint this black? Because that's as much black as I have. That means we can't use black anywhere else. Oh, shoot, Jesus. This with black gesso allowed it to dry completely, and then on top of- Allow to dry? I have to physically sit here and watch paint dry? 70, my grandma. Don't look at me like that, Bob. So we're just gonna take um, all the black we have, put it up here. Bob, Brandon, what have you learned living in your car for three years in LA? That black and white make gray? You proud of me yet, Grandma? Midnight black and a little bit of Prussian blue. Not much Prussian blue, just enough. I didn't use any Prussian blue. <laughs> Bob, I went for more of a liquid white pure black to make a gray, so work with it. As I've mentioned before, these black canvases are fantastic if you wanna if you wanna amaze friends and relatives and etc. because they don't Like my grandma? <laughs> That's exactly what I'm trying to do, Bob. Spot on. Oh no, my white is now gray too. Everything's gray. I'm a dog. I like these black canvases because a little bit of color. Will you stop going on about your black canvas, Bob? You know, I get letters from people every day and they send me photographs of the paintings that they're doing at home. And these black canvases may be some of the favorite. You ever get a picture of a gray canvas, Bob? You're about to. Maybe it comes right on. We don't know where it goes here. Little fluffer there. A what? Bob? A fluffer? <laughs> what kind of studio you at? That's a job I want in my next life. I'm gonna come back and be a cloud and just float around and have a pop. <laughs> Being a cloud's not a job. <laughs> Who's paying the clouds? <laughs> well, nobody's gonna pay for these clouds. I know that for sure. Once again, color shows up so much stronger. If you say black canvas, do you? Fluff them, lift them, tease them, pull them. What am I watch, Bob? This is for my grandma. Flip, pull, what? Bob, oh, children watch my videos. Cheer, tease. It's not, not a very firm pressure on applying that. Just gentle, just gentle. Just enough to grab it and move it a little bit. Bob, are you being dirty on purpose? <laughs> or is that just me? Am I just being... Let me just do these real quick. The thing about subtle innuendos, Bob, is they gotta be subtle, okay? I've had some letters from people in the neighborhood that told me that uh, didn't do too well. You're about to get another letter, Bob, okay? How did I get brown on me? Oh, I hope that's paint. A little Prussian blue. We'll throw some alizarin crimson in there, too. What the heck? What the heck? Why not? Looking for a color that looks very dark, looks black. Why don't we just use okay. black? Graze it, caress it, there. Make good friends with it. <laughs> that looks like snow. Let that paint, and it works so well. It does. This reminds me of my home in Alaska. I used to live in Alaska. Or that don't look like anything you just did. Bob, yours look like mountains. Mine look like moldy rocks in the sky. <laughs> 
Merry Christmas, Grandma. I'm painting you moldy rocks in the sky. Now, if you get one that's too bright and you don't like it, all you have to do is continue to rub it, and it'll go away. It'll go away. There, let's have some fun. Oh, that looks so good. A lot good. of paint, a lot of paint. It don't look good up close, but well, it looks good from y'all there. Right there. Now, if you have problems making your paint stick over this mountain, because there's a lot of paint back here, now, we have color on the canvas already. We have a blue and black mixture. So when we... Mostly green. See that? <laughs> that quickly. Well, we got a whole snowbank in there. Yeah, we did. Little things that hang under the limbs. Little, I call them hangy downs for lack of a better word. <laughs> but they're always an evergreen tree. Those aren't fluffers? Just whack off the bottom. Get it the way we want it. Bob. What? <laughs> Just a second. What'd you do? Thank you, Bob. You've, uh, you've effectively made me the fifth best grandchild. She only has five. Oh, look, I painted my hair on here.